Welcome back to the channel guys, thank you for clicking on the video. Solo card duplication glitch, but a quick word from today's sponsor. Are you guys looking for money and RP services in GTA Online? If you are, check out the links down below DigiZanny and DGZ Gold. You can also use code SG to get 5% off. Let's get it. So in this glitch guys, you do not need custom plates and you wanna be using Arena or Benny's vehicles fully maxed out to dupe. Now, you do need the bunker, you need the MOC and inside your MOC, you wanna put the car that you wanna duplicate inside of the MOC. And yeah, you will need an Eclipse Tower guys. That is the penthouses where you can change the apartment style as well. And yeah, there. I mean, there's not too much to this one. So we're going to enter the back of the MOC and our car we want to duplicate is inside. There we go. So I do have a custom plate on it, but it doesn't matter. You do not need custom plates for this glitch. It is a clean car duplication glitch. So what you're going to do, you're going to drive outside. Not outside, but inside the, MO, inside the bunker. <laughs> I was about to say MOC then. Uh, here we go. So boom. So... The perfect way of getting this part is to do exactly what I do. We're going to edge ourselves forward to the back of the MOC. And once you get the option at the top left of the screen, you want to stop there. So ready now. So perfect. Because the car will brick at the end of the glitch. So we won't be able to drive it. So we just need to get in here and have the option to hit right on the D-pad. From there, you want to exit your bunker. And... From here, um, yeah, guys, uh, sorry, you do need to be on free aim to do this glitch. You need to be on free aim. You can do that by going to story mode and changing it through your settings. Then you want to turn all hired options on, uh, set to custom, so all your jobs are showing on your map. And as I get my map up, you will see all the blue jobs. So again, you do need the penthouse, and this is where you can get a penthouse. So this is where we want to go. So I'm going to job teleport close close as I can to that house so I'm, I'm just going to join this job so x or square to start up the job and you won't see me do it but what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go on to some I'm going to go onto my friends list and someone who's playing GTA online I'm just going to join off their profile because they'll probably play on assisted aim anyway so we will get two alerts so if you get this alert just press b or circle to host now I'm joining my friend he doesn't need to know about it I'm just joining off of his profile to get the alert there we go, accept the first alert, decline the second alert, and that will job teleport you to where you want to go. That, that's a very easy glitch. So we're going to um, head into, uh, well, I'll show you quick, guys. There we go, we're close, but I'll meet you in the penthouse. So from here, guys, you want to go on the interaction menu and select a, a apartment style. You want to press XI on it to preview it. You're not going to be buying it. And here we go. So... Right now, I'm joining off my friend's profile again. As soon as this alert comes up, you're going to spam right on the D-pad and spam B or circle at the same time. And your map should disappear like this. If it doesn't, just do that exact step again until you get it. I did try about 10 times before I got, got used to it. From there, you want to job teleport again over to your agency this time. So you do what we've done earlier, and you, but this time you're going to do it to a job closest to your agency. And you want to have a free LG inside your agency, and you want to change one thing on the LG, like the color of the plate. Now we want to job, job teleport again. Remember, you can't press pause while doing this glitch, so you need to get your phone up and click on the internet, and then you can press pause and get your map up. Now there's no job near my bunker for some reason, so I'm going to job teleport here, and we simply join the job, and we then join off of someone who's playing GTA Online on our friends list. And when we get the alert, we're going to press, we're going to accept the alert and then decline the alert. So here we go. So that's how you job teleport. Um, that part at the, the part at the uh, Eclipse Tower, I'm going to show you again, but at the end of the video, um, just to pinpoint that part, because um, I did foul a few times, but that was a success. So there we go guys, we've gone into the bunker now and the car is still sitting there. And what we're going to do, we're going to get into the car, but it will be bricked. And that's why I told you guys to position the car like I have. And as you see there, the plate did change to a new clean plate. 
So it's a clean card duplication glitch. And as you see, we're bricks, but we have the option to hit right D-pad. That's why we are in this position. So you want to hit right D-pad. And inside the MOC right now is the, you know, the original IC we drove out. We was just sitting in the dupe. We're now sitting in the dupe. So we're now driving this into the MOC. And our original IC will go to where our free LG RH8 was at the agency. And obviously, you know me guys, that's that's where I'm going to prove what I do. So if you can't get out of the MOC, go onto the internet, then press pause, open up your map. And I am going to head over to the agency. We're finished with the glitch now guys. I'm just going to prove to you that the free LG from the agency has now turned into the ISI. So we'll just jump teleporting. Um, I don't need to explain it again. I've, I've, I've mentioned it a few times, but that, we're going to jump teleport. And yeah, I'm going to skip ahead. Um, here we go. So boom, there we go. So that was where the free LG RH8 was. It's now an, the original we see. The dupe is back in the MOC. So yeah, let's quickly run over the apartment part. So here we go. So when you get to your penthouse uh, where you can change your apartment style, you just want to press X or A on any apartment style to preview it. You're not buying it, you're just previewing it. Then when you have that, you want to keep your interaction menu up and stand in front of your house board. Now all we're going to do from here is while we have our interaction menu up, we preview one of the apartment styles then we join for someone who's on our friends list playing GTA online then when you when the alert pops up on the screen you're going to start spamming right on your d-pad and then you're going to spam b or circle depending on your platform once you've done that you will then see this screen flash then you want to back out again as fast as you can and your minimap should be invisible um, if your minimap is still there, you literally just try what we just done again. I'm not going to lie to you guys. It took me between f a good five to 10 tries, probably nearer to the 10 tries side. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'll catch you guys next time.